Now, let's start this adventure proper. Day. Why can't this orb show me things faster? Wanna see what happened to the elf? Okay. Ah, damn it. I hate it when it goes back to the past just to show me the present. Yeah, come on, come on, hurry up. I already know Galvanmore failed. And off go the fingers! I hope that wasn't your favorite, Pinky. That's how real. Aw, oh, they're hugging. I'm having this weird sense of deja vu from the previous game. Yeah, the dorm is good. I'm able to see things going on in the spirit world. I failed you. I stood with Celebrimbor. I wore his ring. We failed to defeat the Dark Lord. The Dark Lord and the Bright Lord are one. A flaming eye above Barakdor. But I sent you to Mordor for the Nazgul. Yes, the things that don't and die, and she has no method finished. of defeating. Look to Minas Morgul, and the Nazgul who dwells within it. You know the one of whom I speak. The Lich King? <laughs> he died. I took the new ring and left him to die. He now wears the ring of Isildur. He belongs to the dark. <laughs> How would she know if she never saw? Falls to you. The Lich King was the only Nazgul at My the Lady place. Kent. Wouldn't she assume him first? Let me come home. You will wear the new ring. You will finish what you started. Then you may return home. It will be done. <laughs> I wonder how long she's been resting there, having this giant eye in the sky looking at her occasionally. <laughs> Atario. Use the force! <sighs> now you have Wraith Fingers! All right, all right, set up all the plan. I said go on to put an ambush and... Ah, shit, she made the Miss Mortal. God damn it! I had two fortresses full of orcs. Well, actually, I only had one, really. No, I had two, yeah. I had two fortresses full of orcs between her and me. Yet she somehow managed to get here. Now oh, I'll have to get to keep a good eye on her. The Light of Galadriel. Hmm, I wonder what she's about to do. My light will be there I'm doing. Ooh. You've been injured. My light will heal.
but she'll no way she'll make it to me. In my fortress, in my area full of orcs, most of which being the enemy. Yeah, I don't. Boom. That's fun. Man, yeah, shame materials against me and not on my side. Or use these powers when we were fighting the Nazgul school previously. Man, no wonder why Caliber more wanted the light of Galadriel. I think would have been awesome. Yeah, it's a bit of a weird light, but it could have worked. <laughs> Green, I know. Boing, boing, boing. <laughs> well, that was hard. Are any of my captains going to spot a Tariel? Let's see. Fees, hunting down. Goddammit. Is there no one who knows how to. Is there no one free? You will find him in the Great Hall. This feels very familiar. Come on, guys. Look to your left. Damn it. So what is that thing you talk Wow, that power is actually really effective. And now it's coming for my head. Alright, now I just gotta figure out where she's going to land and I'll hit push over. God damn it, an ad! Come on. Come on. Don't care about d dogs sporting goods. I own the damn industry! Come on. Come on, finish the ad. Finish the ad, I have an assassin coming for me. No come, on. come on, come on, come on. Ah, finally I had to finish. Oh shit! Hello, Natalia. You will not kill me again. For you fight the Emerald Lord this time. And you know, we didn't fight. Deceived 
Oh, stop that. Ouch. Ah! You wear Isildur's ring. And you wear Calibrae Morse. Ouch! Whoop! I was sent here to kill you. That will not happen. Ow. You serve Sauron. I serve Middle Earth. And the Emerald Lord, who is me? So yeah, I don't really have a master. Ouch. Damn it! Whoop! Ouch! Okay, no more Mr. Nice Haze. The fight is over. I may wear a Sildur's ring, but I am not yet a Nazgul. Stop fighting me! <laughs> You're youthful, she I can tell. She saw the future that has come to pass. She saw the great eye of Baradur. And she also saw the need for a counterbalance. Are you that counterbalance? No. Yes and no. We are. <laughs> I was sent here to kill you. <laughs> me and my armies! You won't stop And me. you if you want. That in the war against darkness, stalemate is victory. Do you still believe that? I believe Mordor and the Nazgul must be contained. Good! But how long can you fight this war before you fall and join them? When the contract's all finished, written up, for me to turn Midas Morgul into so Midas Land. Which won't be happening for at least another few decades at least. So, we're good. We'd be Zara before then? I have my theme park anyway. Now let me show you something rather interesting going on. Look. After the Witch King's fall, an attack commenced against multiple fortresses. And by who? That is what we need to find out. I already sent my ward, my overlords and their armies to do battles across Mordor. So, you don't expect any help. In fact, you have to build me a new army. What? Why me? Because, uh, because I say so. <laughs> I defeated you, you should be glad I didn't decide to brand you. Because I still have that power, even without that ring. This fort would not withstand an attack of ghouls. It's not the ghouls that concern me. My lordship. Attacks have commenced against the other forts. We must prepare. This is unfortunate. If attack now, we will fall. What has happened? Azram's departed a week ago to avenge his blood brother. God damn it! He's Drake's with him. We have not heard from him since yesterday, Thrak. 
was poisoned. No! He confronted Ahisu, who denied responsibility. <laughs> Thra, perhaps deranged by poison, stabbed Ahisu, who then bled to death. It's a wonder you've been able to hold the fort as long as you have. We won't hold it at all without reinforcements. No, I may know a few orcs who could provide the defenses we need. They are unique. Oh. Very well. I must attend to the fortress in Saragost. Saragost? Whereas you now wear the ring. I will not dominate these orcs. Then find a way! But I will bring them back. Good! One way or another. Now you excuse me, Golem and I need to start up plans with the other emerald eyes. This should be interesting. And don't worry. With every he hour you wait, he falls further into darkness. You sent me to kill Nazgul. I will do what is needed when the time comes. Let me to introduce you to uh, the uh, Overlord in charge for the moment. His name is is our cast Slayer of the Dead. I met him during a. Uh, one of my uh, quests, and he has served me well. Helps that he looks fabulous. <laughs> and what can I say? He's rather useful. Don't expect him to do anything. He's the overlord, currently. So, uh, yeah. But then we have his uh, current war chiefs. There's Two Horn, the champion. Kind of a scrungy guy, if I had to be personally honest. You probably could just kick his butt easily. But he gets to summon a grog. Not sure how that makes him a champion, but you know, what can you do, Atario? I'm sorry. Then we have Druk the Blacksmith. Is it anything too special? Just make sure to keep the flies away from him. He's kind of terrified of them, so if we need him to do anything, don't have the flies, please. And then we have Vatra the Dog. A, one of the many apprentices of uh, Grimp Up the Prowler. He also learned a couple things from Drog, being a master of explosives and such. But again, these guys are all war chief. And, uh, yeah. Also, I set a kill order earlier because I thought you were going to kill me before uh, I realized how useful you could be. So. Yeah, he was also trained to be immune to your light attacks and be enraged by it as well. I don't think it'll bother you now that, like, the, you know, order have been, uh, rescinded, let's say. But be careful. That's all I have to say. Thrak the wa Wasp. Ugh. Poor guy. He had such a good hope head on his shoulders too, originally. Then, uh... <laughs> yeah, the poison seems to have gotten to his head. Although it appears to be he got a brand new yellow color scheme, so that's nice. Along oh, with that darkened armor, real good. If you could convince him not to be my enemy anymore, that would be splendid. Then we got Ejmol the Exterminator. Rather interesting fellow. In the fact that he's practically immune to everything. I can only really see combat being an option. But then you have the problem of Frost. Not really working all too well for you, and I'm pretty sure I'm the only one who can freeze people in this land. Now we got Naru, the Deep Dweller. Not sure what to say about him, but uh, I'm pretty sure that you could probably hurt him with your light. I 
to think these old guys joined a clan or something, considering they appear to have the same colors. Eh. Oh well, that explains the Thrax situation at least. But yeah, then we got Ukra of the caves. I'm not sure which caves he came from. Sheila, don't tell me anything. I'll tell you one or two. <sighs> but he's a destroyer with a Karagor pack, so that's something to keep in mind. He's, well... <laughs> I feel like your light attacks are going to really work against him. And the last of these legendary machines that you should be wary of is Pash Webbreaker. Great, dude, we don't have any spiders among us, so no real problem there. But it's, you know, a thing to be wary of. Treat these guys well, and they'll treat you well. I promise you that. So, Tariel, let's see what you can do. Dude, don't worry, just, uh, you know, we search up the mind. No real com problem. Ooh, you can set fronts ablaze, I can see. The power. And your elven light. Hmm, interesting. Linking bolts to other targets and testify. Ooh, I can feel it. For now, let's focus on upgrading your abilities all the way. Because, uh, trust me, you're kind of need it. Let's see what sort of abilities that you've learned through our encounters. You know it executes orcs real nicely. You know how to counter them. Critical strikes, ground finishers, retaliation. You know how to do a spirit step? Spirit chain? How to poison? Brutalize? Utility, detonate, freeze pin, bird of prey. Talon Strike, right? Treasure Hunter, Dragon Rider, Spirit Mount. Wait, wait! You can instantly mount. Oh wait, never mind. I thought I said unbroken. Never mind. I was to say I need I need things in order to do that. <laughs> Unfortunately, you lack my more uh, necromatic abilities. But oh well. I'll try getting a word up to uh, Drog to see if he could spare anybody to come help you. But for now, you're on your own. But, like I said, with Octo the Slayer of the Dead, he should treat you well. He should be loyal. If anything happens, though, be sure to tell me. For if there's one thing I do not hesitate to uh, do, it's execute traitors with impunity. As of right now, you're under my protection. Just remember that, uh... They're on their mind as well. So play nice with my men. Got it, Tario? <laughs> ah! Well, I'm gonna turn off communications. I'm sure you'll do well later on. Hey, Dark! Uh, hey, Golem! Good to see you guys. Now, let's get plotting. 